Dive into the life of Paul Gascoigne, a football star known for his incredible talent on the field and his personal struggles off it. He shined in football, but also faced a tough battle with addiction. This story shares how Gaza's biggest challenge wasn't playing football, but fighting his own struggles. Join us to see how Gaza tried to overcome his battles. Paul Gascoigne, famously known as Gaza, was born and raised in Gateshead, England, where he discovered his love for football at a young age. Despite the challenges of his family's financial struggles, his passion for the game never wavered. Gaza's early years were marked by his dedication to football, playing whenever and wherever he could, often using it as an escape from the difficulties at home. His exceptional talent on the field quickly became apparent, setting the stage for a career that would leave a lasting impact on the sport. Gaza's journey from a young boy with dreams of football glory to becoming one of England's most iconic footballers is a testament to his determination, skill, and the love for the game that drove him from the very beginning. In the bustling town of Gateshead, Paul Gascoigne's childhood was filled with the simple joys of family and football. Born into a tight-knit family, Paul found himself surrounded by love and support from an early age. His parents, John and Carol Gascoigne, worked hard to provide for their family, instilling in Paul a strong sense of determination and resilience. From the moment he could kick a ball, Paul's passion for football was evident. Whether playing in the streets with his friends or watching matches on television, football became more than just a game for young Paul. It became a way of life. Despite the challenges of growing up in a working-class neighbourhood, Paul's love for the sport only continued to grow, fueled by the dreams of one day becoming a professional footballer. In Gateshead, where the streets echoed with the sounds of children playing and neighbours chatting, Paul Gascoigne's journey from a local boy to a footballing icon began. Little did anyone know, the young boy with big dreams would one day leave an indelible mark on the world of football, captivating audiences with his skill, charisma and unwavering determination. Throughout his journey, Paul Gascoigne faced an array of significant obstacles, both within and beyond the realm of football. His internal battles, notably with mental health and alcohol addiction, posed a substantial risk to his bright career, threatening his capacity to reach his full potential on the field. Additionally, Gascoigne's roots in a working-class family brought its own challenges. Financial constraints and limited resources intensified the pressure to excel, compelling him to confront and navigate through the tough realities of his life while chasing his football aspirations. The competitive nature of professional football also presented adversity. Facing rejection and skepticism, Gaza navigated through the demanding environment of youth academies and professional clubs. Despite his clear talent, he found himself continuously proving his worth, overcoming doubts from coaches and critics. Injuries further complicated Gaza's career, posing significant setbacks that threatened to interrupt his progress and love for the game. Each injury tested his resolve and determination, pushing him to find the strength to conquer these hurdles and persist in pursuing his dreams. Paul Gascoigne's professional debut for Newcastle United marked the beginning of a remarkable journey in English football. His raw talent and impressive skills were evident from the outset, immediately capturing the attention of fans and pundits alike. Gascoigne's dynamic style of play quickly garnered attention, leading to his transfer to Tottenham Hotspur for a then-record fee, signifying the high expectations surrounding him. It was at Spurs where Gaza truly rose to prominence, dazzling spectators with his exceptional skill, creativity and flair on the pitch. During Tottenham's FA Cup run in 1991, Gascoigne's performances were nothing short of sensational. He scored crucial goals, including a memorable free kick against Arsenal in the semi-final, earning him widespread acclaim and admiration. His ability to dictate play and produce moments of brilliance was unmatched, culminating in a pivotal role in guiding Spurs to victory in the FA Cup final against Nottingham Forest, where his inspiring performance left an indelible mark on the tournament. Gascoigne's success at club level also translated to international recognition as he earned a place in the England national team. His inclusion in the squad was a testament to his outstanding talent and unwavering dedication. Gascoigne quickly established himself as a key player for his country, notably scoring a stunning goal against Scotland in the Euro 1996 tournament, a moment that endeared him to fans across the nation. His impact both domestically and internationally solidified his status as a footballing icon, leaving an enduring legacy in the sport. 
Paul Gascoigne's impact during the 1990 World Cup in Italy remains legendary in football history. His exceptional talent was instrumental in driving England to the semi-finals, captivating audiences worldwide. However, it was a poignant moment during the tournament that truly defined his legacy. When Gaza received a yellow card, realising he would miss the final if England advanced, his emotional reaction deeply resonated with fans. His tears, reflecting his unwavering passion for the game, mirrored the collective emotions of England's supporters, symbolising both their hopes and disappointments. Gascoigne's transcendent moment went beyond football. He became a symbol of national pride and unity. His status as a national hero was solidified, with his name forever intertwined with the spirit of English football. Additionally, Gascoigne's notable performances and contributions throughout the tournament, including pivotal goals and assists, further cemented his place in footballing history. Throughout his illustrious career, Paul Gascoigne was celebrated for his exceptional talent on the football field, playing a pivotal role in his team's successes. His contributions were instrumental in Tottenham Hotspur's memorable FA Cup triumph in 1991, where he showcased his extraordinary skills and played a crucial part in securing the title. Additionally, Gascoigne's impactful performances also played a significant role in Rangers League title victories, further highlighting his versatility and influence across different teams and leagues. Gascoigne's remarkable achievements were duly recognised with several prestigious accolades. In 1990, he was honoured as the BBC Sports Personality of the Year, a testament to his outstanding contributions to the world of sports. Furthermore, Gascoigne's induction into the English Football Hall of Fame underscored his enduring legacy and profound impact on football, both on and off the field. His remarkable talent, passion and dedication continue to inspire fans and aspiring footballers alike, leaving an indelible mark on the sport. Paul Gascoigne's personal life has been just as eventful off the field as on it, characterised by close relationships with his family and a deep passion for fishing. This hobby serves as a source of solace and peace for him, offering moments of tranquility away from the pressures of professional football. Gaza's love for fishing reflects his appreciation for the simple pleasures in life and his desire to find balance amidst the whirlwind of fame and success. In addition to his upbringing, Gascoigne's own family life has been significant. He has been married multiple times and has children from various relationships. His relationship with his children is especially important to Gascoigne, bringing him joy and serving as a source of inspiration. Despite the challenges he has faced, Gascoigne remains committed to his family, striving to be a positive presence in their lives, despite the demands of his career and personal struggles. Paul Gascoigne's life has been marked by significant moments beyond his football career. His retirement from professional football led him to face numerous personal battles, including struggles with mental health and alcohol addiction. Despite these hurdles, Gascoigne's resilience and attempts to overcome his issues have been inspirational to many showcasing his strength off the field as much as on it. After retiring from professional football, Paul Gascoigne has made significant efforts to address his struggles with addiction, aiming for recovery and personal improvement. His journey has included rehab stints and public discussions about his battles, shedding light on mental health issues within sports. In a candid 2011 interview on ITV's Piers Morgan Life Stories, Gascoigne revealed the depths of his troubles, stating that at his lowest point, he was consuming 16 lines of cocaine and four bottles of whiskey daily. This period represents a stark contrast to the footballing prowess and talent he displayed during his career, highlighting the profound challenges he faced off the pitch. Particularly with alcohol addiction, bipolar disorder and episodes of psychosis, despite undergoing a £20,000 surgery to get anti-alcohol pellets sewn into his body, Gascoigne has experienced multiple relapses, he has openly expressed his struggles, mentioning that he will always be an alcoholic, but tries to take each day as it comes, aiming to be both sober and happy. His issues have been compounded by severe psychosis following cocaine use, leading to frightening experiences of paranoia. At one point, his condition was so critical that rumours of his death spread, following a particularly severe episode where he was hospitalised with life-threatening withdrawal symptoms yet it's also positioned him as an advocate for mental health awareness. Gascoigne's willingness to speak openly about his struggles has helped reduce stigma and encouraged others to seek help, contributing significantly to the discourse on mental health in sports. 
In his career, Paul Gascoigne did some memorable pranks, showcasing his playful and unpredictable personality. From bringing an ostrich to training, causing chaos with fireworks, to moving encounters involving animals and daring escapades, Gascoigne's antics are legendary. These stories reflect not only his character and talent on the field, but his capacity for humour and surprise off it, making him a beloved figure in football history. Paul Gascoigne's legacy in football history is undeniable, leaving a lasting impact on the sport and society. Beyond his skills on the field, Gaza's fearless approach, infectious charm and dedication to the game inspired fans worldwide. His influence stretched across generations, motivating countless young players to pursue their dreams with passion.